Morning guys, Benjamin here. Hey listen, I just had a sales call. I went and met a customer and uh, they needed a certain amount of work done so I looked at it and uh, discussed it and then after we were done talking about it, I uh, looked at him and I asked him, hey, are you a Christian? And he said, no. And I said, well, why not? And he said, well, my grandpa was a Lutheran minister and he said, I went through confirmation and everything, but then um, after confirmation, my parents kind of gave me a choice if I wanted to continue or not, and I, it just wasn't for me. And I said, oh. I said, you know, I was listening to a speaker, and uh, he explained something really well to me that, uh, that we're a spirit, we have a soul, and we live in a body. And uh, because of sin, our spirit man died, and... Um, and so that's kind of why, you know, a lot of times there's that, that big empty hole inside. And I, I say we try to fill it, you know, with I don't know, hunting and fishing and trucks and women and um, all the different things. But it, it just never fills it. And I said it's kind of like an extension cord. You, you unplug it from the outlet and uh, there's just not a power source. And I said that's why, you know, there's that, that emptiness inside. And I said it's something that only Jesus can fill. I said, I was talking to my brother-in-law, and he said, uh, Deion Sanders, after uh, the Cowboys won the Super Bowl, uh, the next day tried to drive his Lamborghini off a cliff. And he said, the, the policeman got there and said, well, we can't write that in the report that, you know, you just lost control. And he said, no, I said, I, I tried to drive it off a cliff. He says, yesterday I won the Super Bowl, and today, now what? And, uh, you know, just all the stuff in this world, it doesn't fill that emptiness. And he said, wow, that's that's a really good explanation shook my hand and said, well, thanks for the talk. I got to go. And he drove away. But, uh, you know, I didn't get to lead him to Jesus. But, you know, I, people, um, they're not coming to church. They're, they're not, you know, lost people are lost people. And if we don't reach out to lost people and share the good news of Jesus, they're not going to hear it. So I just want to encourage you to be bold, take a step, share Jesus with somebody today. Um, there's nothing in life more exciting. Have a blessed day. Bye.